Hello everyone. Hola a todos. Buenos días, buenas tardes o buenas noches a la hora que nos estén escuchando. Ahora voy a presentarles el, el segundo video uh, de video lesson for the students in fourth level in La Salle High School para los chicos de cuarto A y B. El tema de hoy va a ser sobre los super jobs. Un job es un trabajo. O sea, es la actividad que su padre o madre hace para ganar dinero. So, I'm going to ask very random questions. Um, who is he? Is he Roberto? Is he Steven? Is he a doctor? Hmm. Is he a mechanic? Is he a pilot? Who is he? Is he David? Is he Raúl? Is he a doctor? Is he a scientist? Is he a pilot? Is she an astronaut? Is he a teacher? Is he a mechanic? Is she a lawyer? Let's read the little paragraph we have here. <coughs> There are lots of different jobs. Some jobs are in offices. Other jobs are in schools, hospitals and factories. Some jobs are outside in parks or farms. Parents from Oakleaf School are describing their jobs. The children are guessing the jobs. Can you work them out? Bueno, mis queridos padres. Ustedes irán a traducir la mayor parte de esto para que puedan entender, ¿no? Pero voy a decirlos brevemente. Hay muchos y diferentes trabajos. Algunos de ellos son en oficinas. Otros trabajos son en escuelas, hospitales y eh, empresas. Algunos trabajos son fuera, en, en los parques o en granjas. Here we have students probably in the classroom, in the school. Yes? And in the page number 45 we have some people, tenemos algunas personas aquí, ellos van a decir su trabajo a manera de adivinanza, ustedes chicos van a tener que adivinar cuál será ese trabajo, vamos a leer la primera, dice, Mary's mom says, you sit in my big chair, I check your teeth and clean them, las palabras claves están justo aquí. I check your teeth. Yo chequeo tus dientes. And clean them. Y los limpio. So, what is her job? Is she a pilot? No, she is not a pilot. Is she a mechanic? She is not a mechanic. Is she a dentist? Yes, she is a dentist. Let's go with James. James Dad. James Dad says, I drive a tractor. Mm, very easy. I drive a tractor. I feed the hens. Hens son gallinas. Feed es el verbo alimentar. Yo alimento a las gallinas. I milk the cows. And I look after my sheep. Mm, probably he is a farmer. Farmer in Spanish is granjero. Do you think he is a farmer? Is he a doctor? Is he a farmer? Yes, he is a farmer. Let's go with the next one. Wow, it's Ben's dad. I take your order and bring your meal to the table. Okay, un poco difícil, pero vamos a verlo. I, yo. Take es el verbo tomar, coger. Your, 
to order, to orden. Mm, yo tomo tu orden. And bring your meal to the table. Y bring es el verbo traer. Y traigo tu comida a la mesa. So, is he a mechanic? No, he's not a mechanic. Is he a dentist? He is not a dentist. Is he a farmer? He is not a farmer. Is he a waiter? Yes, he is a waiter. La persona que toma su orden y luego la lleva hasta sus mesas. A waiter. Let's go with one more. Jane's dad says, <coughs> I help people in trouble. I drive a big truck with lights and loud sirens. Mm. Help es la palabra ayudar. Yo ayudo a las personas en problemas. Yo drive es el verbo conducir. Yo conduzco un gran camión con luces y una alta sirena. Mm -hmm. So, probably he is a policeman or probably a firefighter. Yes, let's go with one more. Here we have Jason's mom. Jason's mom is next. I help you when you are sick. I give you medicine. Very simple. Yo doy a ti medicina. Who is the person who gives medicine? Yes, she is a doctor. Rebecca's mom says, I cut and color hair. And can, I can make your hair longer or shorter. Hmm. This person cuts and colors the hair. Probably. What do you think? Is she a dentist? She is not a dentist. Is she a teacher? She is not a teacher. Is she a scientist? She is not a scientist. Is she a doctor? No. She is not a doctor. Is she a hairdresser? Yes, she is a hairdresser. Now let's move to the next page. Page 46. We have one more reading, some paragraphs. Recuerde traducirlos y pegarlos en un lugar que se puedan observar los párrafos para que sus niños puedan a cualquier momento abrir, volver a leer y saber qué es lo que dice. Dice el título. Most common jobs in America. These are the top five most common jobs in America. America is the whole continent, but the Americans call it America, just the United States. Así que vamos a ver cuáles son más comunes en Estados Unidos. Number five is a nurse. And what is a nurse? There are more than two million nurses in America. The nurse works work Nurses work in hospitals. They look after sick people. Here we have a nurse, enfermera. Office clerk. Lots of people work in office. Office clerks help organize the office, answer telephones, and type documents. That is a office clerk. One more is a waiter. Waiters are... Waiters are Waiters serve food and drinks. They work in restaurants and cafes. It can be a difficult job. Yes, I have friends who are waitresses. Number two is a cashier. A cashier works in stores. You pay the cashier when you buy a product. You can pay with cash or by credit card. There you have a cashier. And number one, the most popular job, el trabajo más popular y común en Estados Unidos. Salesperson. He is a salesperson. There are more than four million salesperson, six people, salespeople in the USA. They work in stores and sell different things. Salespeople sell food, clothes, furniture, cars, 
and lots more things. Un vendedor. So, to practice right now, I want you to do this. Para que pueda practicar en casa, le va a preguntar sobre diferentes miembros de su familia. Y le va a decir, por ejemplo, <coughs> Is your mother a nurse? ¿Es tu mamá una enfermera? La respuesta sería, Yes, my mother is a nurse. O, No, my mother is not a nurse. De la misma manera que hacía preguntas con las imágenes, ahora tiene que hacerlas, pero con... Con, la, con ese cuadro de las diferencias ahora con estas fotografías Is your mother an office clerk? Yes, she is an office clerk Oh no, my mother is not an office clerk Is your father a cashier? Yes, my father is a cashier Oh no, my father is not a cashier Are you? También puede preguntar si eres tú Are you a salesperson? No, I am not a salesperson. Oh, yes, I am a salesperson. La idea es hacer mientras más preguntas, mejor. Sobre estos jobs y con cualquier persona que usted conozca. Puede ser su brother, sister, uncle, aunt, grandpa, grandma, etc. Let's continue. Dream jobs as superheroes and wizards do not exist. Vamos a dar también una breve leída a estos párrafos para que puedan después terminar las actividades de la página 50 y 51. Let's go. Dream jobs as superheroes and wizards do not exist. But lots of dream jobs are real. Some dream jobs are existing or exciting or glamorous. Others make you famous. Here are some real dream jobs. Algunos trabajos de ensueño, quiere decir esto de dream jobs. La primera, astronaut. Do you like astronauts? Yes, I like astronauts. No, I do not like astronauts. Many kids dream of going into space. NASA looks for astronauts to work on the International Space Station. Some astronauts have degrees of engineering physics or medicine. Other astronauts come from the military. The astronauts. Very nice. One more. Musician. You, do you dream of being a rock band? Some musicians play in stadiums with thousands of fans, but many musicians do not become famous. Many musicians have other jobs too. El trabajo de un músico. One more. Actor. Este voy a traducirlos al español, ¿ok? Actor. Cuando tú ves la televisión o una película, ¿tú sueñas con hacerte fam un actor famoso? Muchos actores trabajan muy duro para tratar de ser famosos. Pero en la realidad, muchos actores no son estrellas. It is kind of sad. Athlete. Muchos niños quieren volverse atletas profesionales. Tú juegas tu deporte favorito y te pagan por esto. Toma mucho trabajo a los atletas practicar por horas, y di uh, por horas en el día con sus entrenadores y compañeros de equipo. Pilot. I like pilots. Do you like pilots? Do you dream of flying? Oh my God, sorry. ¿Tú sueñas con volar? Los pilotos vuelan, vuelan aeroplanos y helicópteros. Los pilotos vuelan a las personas y también carga. Algunos pilotos son eh, están envueltos en operaciones de rescate. Interesting. A pilot. I want to be a pilot. And the question says, Do you dream about becoming a dancer? Or a vet, or a firefighter. What is your dream job? ¿Cuál es tu trabajo de ensueño? ¿Tú sueñas acerca de convertirte en un bailarín o bailarina? ¿En un veterinario veterinaria? ¿O en un bombero o bombera? Piénsalo, think about it, and you are ready to go over these questions. Number 
page number 50 and 51. No more. Thank you very much. Gracias y espero que les vaya muy bien con sus tareas. Y también pueden hacer comentarios en, en Google Classroom. Okay? Goodbye.